What's up everybody? Well, I got another gameplay video for you guys today and today we're gonna chained out trade that bleh, try that chained echoes game again but this time at 1440p now I don't think it's gonna be ultra wide supported but maybe it'll surprise me and it will that'll be cool but even if it's not we're still gonna try it out anyway so before we see any more time let's quickly go over the specs of this guy and then we'll hop into the game this game has no uh, settings or anything to look at really so we'll just jump right in after this so we got a 5800 x3d with negative 25 on all of the cores and we got ourselves a radeon 7900 xtx it's a sapphire nitro plus edition then we got ourselves an asrock x570 tai chi motherboard with 32 gigs of g skill 3600 megahertz cl14 dual rank ram we got ourselves a 360 millimeter ek all in one it's just the basic model no rgb or nothing then we got ourselves a 1000 watt power supply it's a corsair rm1000 gold rated then finishing it up we got ourselves the 45 inch corsair xenion oled monitor now this thing's got g-sync it's got free sync it's got 240 hertz it's got hdr i mean it's got everything you really need the only thing that sucks is since it's only 1440p obviously at 45 inches the pixels per inch is not the highest but when you're playing games and whatnot that doesn't really matter it's not like even in-game text looks bad it just the only text that looks bad is like your desktop icons if you're sitting real close or if you're trying to read a bunch of stuff online constantly that doesn't look spectacular especially for someone like me who's got better than 2020 vision so and then before we get in the second problem for some people it's not a problem for me but it might be a problem for others the stand is connected and it is a part of the monitor you cannot get away from it you can't put a vase amount or anything like that unless you get super creative and like clamp that son of a bitch on there or something or glue it on or jb weld it on i don't know but it ain't going on there standard that's all i can say but now that we got that out of the way let's hop into the game and jump right into the gameplay all right Let's, well, let's get some stats here. There we go. And now let's move around and see if I can't figure out what I'm supposed to do here. There's one of those trollers. Alright, anyway. Where am I supposed to go? I've already stolen a bunch of stuff, but there's still more to do, it seems. Uh, whatever, I'll figure it out eventually. I'll just literally go everywhere there is to go until there's nowhere else. See, look, haven't gone here yet. This is probably where I'm supposed to go. Oh, what do we got? Ooh, all right. I think I remember something like a pot or something make it a guy making a stew or something i bet you i'm supposed to put it in there but i'm gonna have to figure out where the hell that was again oh hey what's up oh i came in through your roof you have a giant hole in your roof you should probably like get that fixed so more people don't keep breaking in your house all right nope i can't go back in but i think that laxative was the only thing in there anyway and if i want to go check again i can just go back and go in the way i came Nope, shouldn't go back in there. I stole from there. Where, oh, where was that damn place with the stew? We sing, we dance, we drink, and then we sing and dance and drink some more. All right, I'm pretty sure I already was in here and did everything I was supposed to do, but I just want to double check. Because I'm running out of ideas here. Did everything there was to do here almost positive so and this is definitely not the place with the stew where the hell was it can't go in there and I'm saying wait a second I still got stuff to do here oh that's the dancing city I already talked to you 
All right, this is the place I wanted. Now we can put the laxatives in. And then wait. Somehow he doesn't notice me standing here. I'm just gonna go over here now. Huh. It'll be fine in a few hours. He's just gotta shit his freaking brains out. What do you guys want? Uh-oh. I've been captured. I knew it was a trap, though. Oh, they probably fooled who a bunch of times. You guys seem pretty stupid. Hmm, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take me a little tiny hit. I steal that, everything's all good. Wow, that guy has quite the uh, nose ring, doesn't he? Although it does look quite crazy even on his little sprite. So it's not paying off the debt. Man, they're late then. More earthquakes, eh? Yeah, they were having a festival, so of course it's going to be all lit up. Anyway, let's move on to camera. All right, guys, let's get ourselves some camera recording gameplay now. Sewers, eh? Nothing to steal. There we go. 
go. Now, do we have... No. Oh, I can't get to that from here. Oh, yeah, right. I don't want to fight that right now. team up now. It'd be great to have three people versus just her. She's cool and all, but I don't have any heals, and I know that one guy, if I remember correctly, heals. So long as he's got enough, what you call it, TP. I think that's plenty of gameplay. So let's go wrap this video on up. Well, all right, guys, that's a wrap for Chain Echoes on the secondary computer. And obviously it played it flawlessly. Not ultra wide, but still pretty much 240 FPS all the time. So that's good at least. And gladly, or happily, 
played it flawlessly. So, always glad when things play all good, but with a game that looks like that, you know, you pretty much expect it to. But you never know for sure until you try. But, in any case, that's all I got for you guys for this particular video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, because I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys. And until the next video, peace out, guys.